Sometimes we need to use a stair runner in our projects. Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial from the Nice Tower channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create this stair runner. Before that, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. Like the video and share it with your friends. So let's jump it. First, by using 1001 bit tools plugin, create a staircase. In here, you can change the tiles. So I'm gonna use Ascension details. As you can see, now we have a staircase. So let me get here. Draw a line and push pull it. And here too, push pull up to here and erase this line because we don't need it. Test mode, we need a copy from the top of the staircase. So after select all, deselect some face that we don't need it. Now by using Ctrl C, take a copy, then go to edit and click on paste on place. Then select here and scale it a little bit. It's okay. So now move it to the middle and here too select and scale and also move it to the middle and now go here and draw a rectangle by 15 centimeters then select this line and also move it 50 centimeters. So now erase this line because we don't need it anymore. So let me select all. I think it's better to hide the staircase first. So now as you can see in here, we have some lines that we don't need it. So we should delete this line. As you can see, we have a simple face. So now select all and by using for it to join push pull, extrude it a little bit. So it's enough. And now by using line tools, separate this space from here to here and here too. So and now we need a carpet texture. So I download it before and also you can download the texture from here. 3D warehouse, go here and search in here, Easter carpet and go materials. There is a lot of Easter runner texture. You can use it. I choose this texture. And by right click, explode it. So after that, by holding the Alt key and click on it, take a copy. So let me select all and put it the color 
As you can see, it's not good. It's regular. So what should we do? First, select the texture and move it and line the carpet. Just note that the weight of the texture should be same as the weight of the carpet. First, let me select here and put it the color. As you can see now, it's better. It's fixed. So after that, select the texture and move it and line the carpet. And first select all and put it the color. As you can see, now it's fixed. And now by rotate the texture and move it and line the carpet. You can fix here. So guys, as you can see, it's done. I hope this tutorial was useful for you. For more tutorial, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, like the video and share it with your friends.